Hello, people of the internet, my name is Johnny, and welcome to Bendy and the Ink Machine. With Bendy in the Dark Revival just around the corner, I thought now would be the best time to go back and revisit the first Bendy game in preparation for the next game coming out on November 15th. It has been a long, long time since I've last checked out any sort of Bendy media in regards to the first game. In fact, I just recently, like, before recording, went back, redid the first chapter. It was a lot longer than I thought it was, but that's what we're going to be doing in today's video. And over the next couple of days, we'll make our way through chapters 2 through 5 and relive all the memories and preparation for the next game, which I'm very, very excited for. So without further ado, let us hop into chapter 1, Bendy and the Ink Machine. Dear Henry, it seems like a lifetime since we worked on cartoons together. 30 years really slips away, doesn't it? If you're back in town, come visit the old workshop. There's something I need to show you. Your best pal, Joey Drew. I'm on my way, Joey. I'm coming back, man. Chapter 1, Moving Pictures. Alright, Joey. Oh, Joey. I'm here. <laughs> Let's see if we can find what you wanted me to see. Let us find what you wanted me to see. Bendy and Sheep Songs. Boris! I miss you, buddy. Back at it again at Joey Drew Studio. So like I said, I did replay chapter one before recording just to get the feel of Bendy, uh, which I do regret because now I know exactly what I have to do. And also, uh, you know, my reactions won't be genuine, at least for the first chapter. Hey, here's my old desk. I wasted so much time in this chair. But it's still really cool to come back. It's been so Looks long. Like I knocked out a wall or two after I left. Guess it took a few people to replace me. I guess. Yeah, honestly, I know there are some people split on Bendy making a comeback because the creators, which I honestly, you know, completely understand that point of view. But personally, god dang, I am so, so hyped for Dark Revival. It's been so long since that game was teased, and knowing it's actually coming out in like a week by the time I'm, I'm recording this, it's really, really cool, and I'm extremely hyped for it. Anyways, can't go in there. I do believe we need to make our way to the ink machine, which is down here. Ink output schedule. Uh, wow. <laughs> 4.23 on Saturday? Or no, that's not- wait, they're missing us a, a day. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Huh? Anyways, Joey, I'm not gonna question how you run your business down here, but here's the ink machine. Um, yes, it definitely could. And I think they're just out this way. Here we go. Battery number one, and number two is right here. Put this is, down there, old friend. Uh, we will be playing like the revamped versions of each chapter. Oh, I need to <laughs> pull the switch. I'm like, oh, it's, it's not coming up. So this is very different from the debut of chapter one. That's such a sick reveal. God dang, it's massive. The ink machine. Now all we're missing is Bendy. Oh wait, no, here he is. Turn on the ink machine, locate the power station. Okay, and I think I remember where that is. I believe it's down this way. The store opened up. Hello? I don't think I went down here, actually. Um. Soup. Wonderful, wonderful. Uh, what's this? Is this a stay? Yes, a save station. What do you say? Get overtime for this? That's nice. Work hard, work happy. I'm good, Bendy. Okay, can't go down this way. Let's go back up. More soup. I feel like there's there's got to be like an achievement or something for eating all the soup cans. Where the heck did that fall from? All right. <gasps> Boris! No! I forgot about Boris. No. Mm, Boris, buddy. Isn't there a way I can give you a bone? Wait, no, hold on. I'm looking this up. Okay, apparently that's not till later chapters, but don't worry, Boris. I will give you that bone, buddy. I'll do it just for you, man. All right, let's head out this way, and this is the power station, right? right how yes. Do I get this to work? And thus begins the ever loving fetch quest. <laughs> Awesome. A staple of the Bendy series. Which, apparently, according to Meatly... <laughs> hey, buddy. I don't know. 
Uh, but apparently, according to the Meatly on Twitter, there will not be any fetch quests in Dark Revival, which I'm happy about because I think we can all agree, love her to hate Bendy, the first game was just a massive fetch quest. Uh, which now we are embarking on. Uh, ooh, there's a tape here. Can't go in. All right, let's play the tape. Wally. <laughs> Can I walk away? Don't blame him. There it is. Okay. Fair. I'm out of here. The iconic Wally Franks catchphrase. Gotta love that. Locked. Open. Uh, just more soup. Awesome. <laughs> I'm not gonna go through and eat all the soup. I feel like there's gonna be a lot of soup. Uh, ink pressure. That's not what I'm looking for. Is there any... anything in the bin? No. <laughs> oh, oh, right. It's on the chair. And I'm stuck on a chair. Here we go. Squeak. Punching in. <laughs> Punching in. This is a book. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The Illusion of Living by Joey Drew. All right, then. Nice. Thank you. Thank you, Music Room. I think the um, item is right here. Yep. The Death Ink. <laughs> Who wouldn't want to have that? What else am I missing? I got the ink, I got the music disc, got the book, the plushie. Shoot, what else? There's a gear, and I think... Oh, there's one other thing. No, I definitely heard a door open. Alright, sure. Alright, what do I have? Plushie, music, ink, no gear... Wrench and book. Oh, I got the wrench. So where's the gear? Shoot, I forget where that gear is. Aha. That makes sense. Back at the ink machine. All right, sweet. So we got all of them. We can go turn it on. And I think there's some other power we have to turn on. Here we go. Now I just need to get got the it. ink flowing somehow. Should be a switch around here somewhere. Then I can start up the main power. Okay, the switch, I think, is down near the projection room. Either that or it's the switch in the ink. No, I'm going the wrong way. Um, like, drawing place. One of them's a fake one, and I can't remember what... Oh, hey. <laughs> hey, man, how are you doing? How's it going, man? All right. Oh, that's not good. Oh, no. Oh, I've got an ink all over the place. Oh, shucks. Well, not my problem. I'm not the janitor. I'm an illustrator. Turn on the ink machine. Here we go. Yeah, there's definitely a lot of noises. Definitely a lot of noises that shouldn't be making noise. Definitely a lot of noises. Anyways, back at the ink machine power. Let's flip it. There we go. Yeah, it don't sound too good. Anyways, let's go back to the ink machine. And I believe this should be the big ending chase sequence. Oh, yeah, here it is. <laughs> All right. Hey, Bendy. Jesus. Hey. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Jesus. <laughs> Does he actually chase you? Oh, that's a lot of ink. That's a lot of action. That's actually a lot of ink and steam in my face and falling boards from the ceiling. Okay. Yeah, no, this whole place is falling apart. Does they actually chase you? Oh, I can't go back. Oh, well, that's lame. Immersion broken, but all right, here we go. Yeah. Not the, the most sturdy of, of buildings. Drain the ink. Here we go. Just pull this valve. Nice. Is this another cassette? You betcha.
So that is Thomas Connor, and I'm actually gonna find a way to turn up their dialogue. Oh, well, never mind. And he is the repair handyman, and I believe he actually is the one that made the ink machine for Joey, if I'm remembering my bendy lore right. Uh, what did that say? Oh, danger keep out. Oh, wonderful. Yeah, no, I'll just hop right down then. No, I'll just hop right down. After draining this ink, watch your step. It is just stairs, though, so it shouldn't <laughs> be that worrying of, of steps to take. What's this? What does that say? The lighter side of hell. Okay. <laughs> Sounds like a, a upbeat song. Drain this ink. I wonder if there's, like, bendy speedruns. I, I want to do some bendy speedruns. I don't know. This seems like a fun game to be able to go quick in. This will definitely come in handy. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm coming at you now. Oh, yeah, you don't stand a chance, Bendy. Is there anything in there? Another bone. Huh. I do wish I could give it to Boris, but he's... He's dead, unfortunately, and I can't give him a bone until the next chapter, I think. Anyways. Breaking down the boards. Ah. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> Jesus, okay. <laughs> Wasn't even supposed to be a jump scare. It still got me harder than the Bendy jump scare. And I think that's where chapter one ends it. I honestly forgot they, they kept in the hallucinations. I thought that was one of the things they got rid of in the new um, builds of the chapters. I guess not. Anyways, here's a preview for chapter two in next video. What happened? What happened? J crikeys, jinkies. What the hell happened here? Get up, Henry. There's only one thing to do. Press on. <laughs> I was like, yeah, well, what is that thing? See if I can find a way out. And that is exactly what we will be doing in the next episode where we explore the entirety of Bendy Chapter 2. Thank you so much for watching this video. Hope, you, hope you're going to enjoy the series. I know we mostly do FNAF around here, but Bendy is another series that I'm honestly a big fan of. So I, I, if you're not a big fan of Bendy, please stick around, you know, give it a chance. Either way, thank you so much for checking out a non-FNAF video, and I'll see you all on the flip side. Goodbye.